you get that call in there in the fifth or the sixth, excuse me, just, you know, what was going through your, your head as you come into the game and, and try to shut them guys, shut them down? Yeah, just execute pitches. You know, when we were briefed on their, their game plan, you know, they're going to take a lot. And, you know, we, we just, the adjustment from last weekend, you know, we weren't really pitching to execute. We are just pitching to get guys out. So, you know, the focus preparing for them this week was just executing to the glove. You know, that was pretty much my mindset going through. And, you know, it was a good game plan. We prepared well and, you know, it worked out well. How has it been adapting to kind of this starter slash long reliever kind of role? It's been, it's been good, honestly. It's, um, you know, I did it all throughout high school, so it's not, nothing really new. You know, it's, it's kind of that mindset, you know, I've done it before. You know, there's, there's really no hassle. And, uh, you know, it's been cool to pitch in a bunch of different roles, you know. It's, it kind of lets you know that the coaching staff, you know, trusts you a lot. And then, you know, you're good for not just out of the pen or closing or, you know, for starting. You know, you're good for everything. So it's pretty, it's pretty cool to have that kind of reputation on the teams. What did you think of your stuff today? Uh, it, was, it was pretty good. Fastball was riding well. Uh, changeup wasn't breaking as well as it has been, but you know I think I located it pretty well today, so that was good. And uh, yeah, slider was it was doing it. So you know, it was just the focus was just executing. Um, you know, it doesn't matter like how good your stuff is if you can execute pitches, man. You're doing pretty well. On that strikeout at Costello, he used a changeup down and in under his bat. That's what Stoffel did yesterday. Is that something that you guys have kind of honed in on? And you know, Waz just talked about how you know he's a good hitter. He'll hit, he'll hit basically any pitch. But is that something that you guys have kind of keyed in on as a staff, as a rotation? Yeah, Costello was a special case this weekend because he's. We were briefed on that. He was their best hitter. He was going to be the one that do, do, does damage in you know first AB. He goes yard yesterday. Mm-hmm. So, you know, we we knew we had to be wary of him, and. Uh, yeah, and that count, you know, I just can't give him anything to hit. So, you know, you, the thought process there for the changeup is just bury it. You know, if he's going to swing at it, let him swing at it. You know, he's not going to do any damage with it. So, You have nine free passes so far this season and I think ten innings now. Just you, this early kind of com- command struggles, just is there a thing that you're attributing to that and that you're trying to, uh, you know, work on in, in your bullpen sessions? Yeah, no, it's just, you know, it's just walks, you know. You can't really – get caught up in the in the stats of it all. I don't really pay attention to my stats at all during the season. I just like to go out and pitch. Mm-hmm. You know, so that's really kinda of what I look at. So nine free passes who cares really. It's kinda of my thought process through it. Do you feel like you've not been able to hit all your spots or you're still hitting them and you just happen to be walking guys? Uh I just think, you know, hitters are doing a good job especially early in the season just working the counts. You know, so you know all I can do is just pitch to the best of my ability that I got that day. So, you know, if I walk six guys, I walk six guys, you know, but I'm a, if I get out of the inning, if we win, you know, that's pretty much all that matters to me. It doesn't matter how many guys I walk. That ball hit down the line to Ceballos. Does your, your heart kind of jump on that ball? I don't think I had time to since it was hit so hard. <laughs> <laughs> so luckily he made a good play on it. And, you know, we trust Sabine, you know, a lot. And, you know, he's a very good player, very good infielder. So, you know, I have a lot of trust in him. And he's done it before in the scrimmages. So, you know, a lot of what has happened, especially over the season, has already happened in the scrimmages. So, mm-hmm. um, it's good to know that we've prepared for it and we've seen it already. So.